Jimmy, please say something. James? What? Who are you? Mom, I thought you told me never to talk to strangers. Like I said before, Jimmy, please be nice to your new stepfather. Okay, rich guy. I love it that you're twice as old as my grandfather and you're fat and bald. Uh. That's enough! I've had it with you, you little brat! You've upset your mother. I've got half a mind to beat you. Half a mind is right. Suddenly he realizes. I can't believe you, you little monster. We'll deal with you when we get back from our honeymoon. Next year. Boy, bull worth the cannon. Have fun, Jimmy. I'll think of you from our cruise ship. <laughs> Whatever. Mom, why'd you marry that phony? What is wrong with you? Oh, I can't believe this. You must be the huh? Hopkins boy. Where'd you come from? We've been expecting you. Welcome to Bullworth Academy. Ah, I'm sure you'll be very happy here. Very happy indeed. Anyway, I can't spend my life waiting around for naughty little boys. I've got a man to make happy. The headmaster is expecting you, Hopkins, in his study. Okay. His study is over there, boy, in the main building. Don't keep Dr. Crabblesnitch waiting. He's a brilliant man. Brilliant. I just hate you! Look familiar? Get closer! Good day! Never mind. I was confused. There's just so much to do, I'm totally stressing out. Have you ever 
ever studied Carter G. Woodley? Say I'm a genius. I doubt it. I wish I could go to school seven days a week. LA is lithium and a Hello there, ma'am. Ah, yes. So, you must be Hopkins. Uh, uh-huh. What? Uh-huh. What? I meant yes, sir. Very good. Now, let me see. You've done a lot of naughty things, haven't you? Vandalism, graffiti, bad language, violent conduct, disrespecting staff. Oh, I'm scared of you, Hopkins. Come on, give me a break. Yes, I've never met a boy like you. Never in all my life. Hopkins, you're quite the nastiest little boy I have ever encountered. Tell me, why should I waste my time on you? I don't know. Because it's my calling. It's what I do. You excel at causing trouble, and I excel at fixing little boys like you. At making you into respectable members of our community here at the Academy. I've got a good feeling about you, boy. A feeling you and I are going to be great friends. You keep that nose clean, boy or I shall clean it myself. Miss Danvers, are you back yet? Yes, Headmaster, and I got your tea. You are good to me, Miss Danvers. No more than you deserve, Headmaster. Take our new friend Hopkins here and show him around the school and get him properly attired. Certainly, Headmaster. Come along, boy. I haven't got all day. And boy, remember, you will have a clean nose. So keep it clean, or we'll clean it for you. So here I am at probably the worst school in the country, whose alumni are nothing but arms dealers, serial killers, and corporate lawyers. Real scum. And that old creep thinks he can tame me? We shall see, my friend. I only give people what they have coming to them. Where's your uniform, young Hopkins? Run along now, child. I love to study in the library. It's so peaceful, the and there are no flies. Don't look at me! You're so almost down here! What time it is? Yep, time for a beatdown! Get the new kid! Beat him down! Kick it easy! Give him a finisher! Give him a finisher! Finally, some good old teenage blood! 
bloodshed! It's a freaking massacre! Oh, oh! Use the arm bar! Use the arm bar! Ha ha, yeah! Take him to hell! Ha ha ha! Oh! Oh, he's getting beat! Ha ha, yeah! Take him to hell! Ha ha ha! Oh, stuff that door quad's head up his butt! Kick his knees in! Finally, some good old teenage bloodshed! That's wicked! Oh! Oh, he's getting beat! Shove that door quad head up his butt! One! That sucked, man! Seriously, that was the worst! <laughs> You're dead, new kid! Dead! Hey, you! Break it up! That's enough of that! Break it up! Why are you not in your uniform, young man? Go change immediately! Aw, oh, come on! Hey, you're the new kid. Yeah? What's it to you? Friendly, aren't you? Give me a break, loser. Hey, relax, friend. You're all pent up. Go easy or they put you on medication. They did to me. Boy, you nearly sent me insane. That's fascinating. Now if you'll excuse me... I said me. relax, friend. Get off, man. Listen to me, tough guy. You just arrived at the toughest school in the country, and I'm offering to be your friend. Trust me, in a place like this, you're gonna need friends. So it's up to you. You gonna play nice, or what? Yeah, sure. Good. So how about I show you around? We don't have a bar in the dorm, just a soda machine. Lame boy. Can you just leave me alone? Like, I want a stinking friendship bracelet. Jeez. Just you should I probably know. change into your uniform if you don't want to get in trouble. But I never judge myself. Hey, how you doing? You must be the new kid. I'm Pete. Pete Kowalski. Jimmy Hopkins, and don't ask how I'm doing. I've been here five minutes, and already people want me dead. Even my parents didn't hate me this quickly. Well, welcome to Bullworth. It's a dump. Great. I've been expelled from anywhere halfway decent. Yeah, I've been expelled from anywhere halfway decent, because I'm really bad. Give up the tough guy act, pal. Hey, man, what's your problem? Well, ADD primarily, but also life. My parents, this school, Western civilization, but really, honestly, enough about me? Oh, I see you've met the dorm's mascot. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Femboy, the girliest boy in school. Petey, haven't you got some imaginary friends to go annoy? Why don't you leave me alone, Gary? <laughs> Look at you. Leave me alone, Gary. I'm really self-important now that I finally hit puberty. What's your problem? I'm just being nice to the new kid as he passes through Bullworth on his inevitable journey to prison. Look, I gotta unpack. Would you guys mind getting out of here? <laughs> oh, now look what you've done, Pete. Jimmy can't stand you already.
I will not tolerate what indiscipline. Do you have, foul villain? I can see you all die. See? I'm telling you. If you do it for one of the big I don't get how Grease is getting chicks. I mean, what do they got that I don't? Girl, you can do your best. No one but will with Wade or his friends. I'm gonna make you the last. No. Not Oh no! Not again! Hey, Jimmy! Let me show you around this prison. That's Russell's locker. You know, the big ape who almost put you in the hospital. Enough talk! Now I smash you! Bother with me. Time to pay your Russell tax. I'm really sorry. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Destroy. This just enough. Not to smash you. Come on. Let's break into it and steal something. That'll teach him. Careful around the prefects. They don't have much of a sense of humor. Little brain, this way. Oh my god! Oh, my oh god. man! Oh my god. There's that weird chick, oh, Eunice. Let's no. have some fun with her. <laughs> Go! Let's see what she wants. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! 
What's going on? <laughs> he took my chocolate! Please get it back! You should be ashamed of yourself. Be careful, idiot! Feeding time at the zoo. Okay, here's the deal. Over there, we got the nerds. Of course, they're complete social outcasts. They look pretty harmless. They're actually sneaky bastards. Their turf is the library. And those are the preps. They're all money and condescending attitudes. Yeah, massively inbred and completely brainless. Very observant, Jimmy boy. Now, over there are the greasers. They think they're tough. Or at least try to look tough. Wouldn't advise messing with them, at least not yet. They hang by the auto shop. And last but not least, the jocks. These guys rule the school. Definitely avoid them. Whatever, I'm not afraid of some dumb roid monkeys. You'll learn. Come on, let's go. You're here to learn, not to goof off. Get to class. What are you doing in here? Oh, right. Class. Take care to follow my instructions precisely, as we will be working with volatile chemicals today. Careful! Young man, stop daydreaming! Keep up the good work. You're almost done. Fascinating, isn't it? Good job. Keep paying attention. Satisfactory work, James. I'll see you next class. I'm awesome! <laughs> There was never any doubt. Rule breaking. I'm gonna love growth. busting you up. Ooh. 
Your move, Dillweed! You seem to be making yourself quite comfortable here, my boy. I'm just trying to fit in. By fighting? By making a nuisance of yourself? That is not the Bullworth way, boy. Yeah, you could have fooled me. What? I said you could have fooled me. This place is full of bullies and maniacs. Nonsense! That's just school spirit. Hijinks. Why, in my day, we felt nothing of castrating the new boys. I want you to stop this nonsense, Hopkins. I want you to behave yourself. You might learn something. Fine. Can I go now, sir? On your way. Hey, I saw you sucking up to Crabble Snitch. What? Shut up. Screw you, new kid. This is what we do to teachers' pets around here. You better not. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> come here, you little. Yeah, come and get me. You're a whip, new kid. Sorry! I just hate you! I saw him, he ran towards the film. I'll get him! Out of here! <laughs> <laughs> what you gonna I'll do? I'll break every bone in your scrawny little body, chump! You better run! If I better. catch you, you're over! Oh. Done! Finish! Oh. Look at the pimp before you go! Oh, God, my friend! Such a good idea now. Stop. Does oh, it? I'll hit you hard.
I should teach lessons or something. When will these kids learn? Ah, hello, class. The curriculum demands that you do these vocabulary uh, assignments. Why don't you finish them here in class? That way you'll have more free time. Well done. I'm afraid that's not English. That has to be some sort of slang, yes? I don't think that's in the dictionary. Good show. Try again, James. That's right! That has to be some sort of slang, yes? I don't think that's in the dictionary. Good one. Try again, James. I'm afraid that's not English. I don't think that's in the dictionary. It's all right, James. You can always do the assignment next class. I can't wait for someone to break a rule. Darling, you need this. You need this. I 
I get along with everyone. That Russell sure has great jokes. I need a crotchless wonder! Lose your head! I wanna be a cinematographer. No escape from the Trent Man! So that's a good idea, right? Yeah, okay, <laughs> alright, sure, I'll do it. Hey man, what's going on? Not much. I was just telling Petey here about my idea to take over the school. I mean, my plan for us to take over the school. What plan? Don't worry, Jimmy. It's just a little something I came up with. It's sink or swim, my friend. And if you're good at swimming, you gotta let the losers drown. Why don't you guys leave the thinking up to me? What? What? What, what the? Can't you say anything else? <laughs> you know what, Petey, you were right. Jimmy is pretty dumb. What'd you say about me? Whoa, nothing, no, no, no. All I said was that you had to be pretty dumb to get expelled from so many schools, that's all. <laughs> Relax, James. All he said was that you must be dumb. Or maybe you're all messed up because you came from a broken home. What'd you say about me, dwarf? Come on, dude, chill. No, 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 no. Gary's taking everything out of context, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't lie, Petey. Don't you lie. Because you know what happens to liars? No, no, I'm not lying. We kick them in the balls! <laughs> Come on, Jimmy, let's go see how good you are with this new slingshot I heard you had. Don't worry, friend. Nothing escapes my notice. I hear everything. You and me, we can do things. Hey, Jimmy, follow me. You know, despite all this... Why don't you prove yourself to someone who cares? Hey! See if you can knock out the windows in that bus. I want to see your long range skill. See if you can get him with your slingshot. I'm a genius. Geniuses don't need medication. Friends? Friends are for the weak. Come on. That's not trash.
hide in that tree so you can mess with them. I'm gonna take a seat on the bleachers to watch the fun. I know I'm a good kid. I wonder what F
Go on, Petey. Go cry to the teacher. Tell them I was nasty to you. Shut up, Gary. You're such a jerk, man. Oh, am I, Petey? Oh, you're so cutting. I'm really upset. Actually, I think I'm gonna go cry. Then I'd be just like you. Cry, little girl. Oh, look out. <laughs> Here comes Jimmy. Just knock it off, Gary. You're out of line. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize I was hanging out in the girls' dorm. Silly me. Shut up, man. You're boring. Boring? I'm boring. You're none too interesting yourself, friend. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry, both of you. I apologize, okay? I just get a little overexcited. Forgive me. Forget it. It's cool. Anyway, I've got a good idea for some fun. Let's go out and torment someone really helpless and unfortunate. That homeless guy. <laughs> Come on. You coming, little Petey? Come on, I'm sorry. I'll give you a kiss if that's what you want. Shut up. Then come on. This is gonna be fun. Harassing some old homeless guy is fun. It is, and you should be grateful you're not the victim for once. I guess. Hey, Jimmy, tell me about this guy. Does he like to go in his own pants? You're crazy! I like to buy stuff for people, so they will like me. Why do I get so nervous around toys? Where is this dirty old perv? You know, you're not very nice, Gary. And you're a loser, Petey. One of life's unfortunates. Get out of here, you little oh, scum! <laughs> <laughs> so I guess the rumors are true, Jimmy. Your dad does live on scum! campus. You jerk! Ow! Let's leave this guy to his welfare payments. Come on, let's get out of here. Just get out of here, kid. Why should I? Because otherwise I'll kill you. What's your problem? <laughs> That's a long story. You got any liquor? No, I'm 15. Well, what about drugs? No. Then why shouldn't I kill you? All right then, tough guy, kill me. <laughs> you know what, kid? I like your style. You got guts. When I was on that ridge in Korea, watching my buddies get killed by friendly fire, I could have used somebody like you. Yeah? Thanks. But I bet you can't fight. You do me a favor, and I'll show you some real moves. Classified moves. Real special army stuff. Cool. Just get me a part for my radio, and I'll show you what the army taught me. What, like how to get shot by your own side? Exactly. Watch out for Russell.
can use that. Bottom of the barrel, no hope. Thanks, kid. You're one of the good ones. I learned this one from this crazy guy I shared with. Yeah, okay, he was my brother. Work. Now go out there and kick some ass! Scared of an old drunk, huh? Don't forget to bring me a transistor when you come back! That was easy. Chinga better than Kyoko Yoshini. Have you seen that Bye crazy then. homeless guy outside the old... Anyway, I'll give you whatever you want. Just Oh, so, you're the new kid, huh? Everyone is talking about you. Oh, are they? And what are they saying? Uh, nothing. Just that you're friends with that sociopath Gary. Socio-what? 
sociopath. It means... Never mind. Forget I said anything. I need you to help me. Wait, you need me to help you? I've got some library books that need to be returned, but I'm too scared to go to my locker. Do I look like a librarian? No, listen, I need your help. Pretend we're friends. Walk with me. I'll pay. <laughs> I'll pay you two bucks. Two bucks? Are you crazy? Make it five. No. Two bucks? Great. Five bucks. Let's go, buddy. <laughs> You know, Lola, she's really hot and actually talked to me the other day. I think maybe she wants to be my girlfriend or something. <laughs> Greetings and salutations. You really have to call me when you get nervous. I do. I get nervous a lot. Hey, Algernon, I heard you wet your bed again. <laughs> I've already wet myself once this month. If I do it again, they'll never let me hear the end of it. You are violating your academic contract. Did you ever, you know, <laughs> Cover me! I'm going in! Hey! Were there two people in that stall? <laughs> they went into the bathroom. No more messing around! <laughs>
You got some nerve. Truxy is disrupted to the full work order. I'm going to nip your crime. Here it is! Thanks, Jimmy! Here's the cash! I'll tell my mom that not everyone at Bullworth is mean! Ain't no stopping Jimmy Hopkins! Let me guess! Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Miss Phillips, and it is my pleasure to induct you into the world of arts. Such passion in your work. Very Hey, you. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I thought you might like these. Jimmy, you're so nice to me. Just you and me. Mmm. That was... nice. <laughs> That's how you do it! Another good deed done. Nothing, bum. Okay, Jimmy, here's the plan. Well, all right. Thanks. I'm not a pessimist. I'm just in a bad mood. Permanent. Your move, Gilweed. Just take some pills. That's what my parents do. Works for them. <laughs> what a lightweight.
Hey, you. I really like your outfit. Much obliged. I think we can call that a wrap. Shove it! No escape from the trick man. <laughs> ah, the taste of chemical burn. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. Get out! Stop, Gary. <clears throat> I'm trying to watch this. Ah, swim team. Intellectual stuff. So, tell me, Petey, do you Come like on. watching the girls in their swimming costumes? Does get, that fuel your filthy little fantasies? Gary, just get out of the way. Oh, Marion, show me your breaststroke again. Or... Wait, do you like the boys on the team? Yeah, right, Gary. Which is it, Petey? I see you guys are getting along as usual. I'm just toughing Ow. them up. Ow. Turning them into a man or a woman or something. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Petey. Ah, oh, peace stain. Good to see you. Listen, Jimmy, I need a favor. Bucky went to the auto shop to get some parts for his science projects. He hasn't come back yet. I think he might be in trouble. Please? Why don't you go yourself? I've got homework. <laughs> okay, I'm frightened. And I've got a weak bladder. Oh, I think the bullies might have gotten him. Please, I'll pay. I say do it. It's a good chance to show Russell who's in charge around here. Now run along, Ow. peace stain, before you mark the carpet. Yes. We've got to take care of Russell and his boys. Then, after that, take care of all the other cliques. Soon, this school will be ours. I don't want the school. Yeah, well, I do, pal, and I intend to get it. Now go help that door. And what are you gonna do? I've got planning to do. Knock it off. <laughs> Sorry. <Boop>. Stop. <laughs> Sorry. Bucky, fight back! I mean, you're dead! I'm gonna make you and your boyfriend pay for this!
You like that crane? Ha! It was a tiger, not a crane. I'm coming, Mr. Nice to know there's a violent, crazy old man on campus. Thanks, Jimmy. That's great. Here, take this. My work here is done. When I see one more little freshman try to walk by me without saluting, I'm gonna flip my freaking lid! Oh, oh so you're gonna start fighting, huh? Get to your designated class! Give it back! Or what? Or, well, just give it back! Are you threatening me, Metal Mouth? No, I just, just give it back! You can't just steal things from me! <laughs> Unfortunately for you, my pig ugly friend, that is exactly what I can do. In fact, I can do anything I like in this place. Anything at all. Ciao, Spotty. Give it back! And you should stay out of the girl's dorm, you little perv. Ugh, I see you undressing me with your eyes. Sicko. You wish. Please, will you help me? Do I have to? Yes, it's vital. She's stolen my lab notes. Without them, I'm gonna fail chemistry and I'll never get into med school. Now I won't find the cure for cancer. Basically, the future of the whole world rests on those notes. What's in it for me? Well, if you get them back, I'll... I'll kiss you. Ugh. Uh, that's okay. Well, okay, but... If you don't, I'll tell the whole school you're some kind of sad sicko who spies on girls getting changed in their dorm. Relax. One set of lab notes coming up.
Here you go. Oh, Jimmy, thank you. You're wonderful. You're amazing, you know that? I hope it gets easier. That's that nonsense dealt with.
The time has come for me to show my... Hey, Beatrice, what's wrong? Two things. Firstly, my cold sores are totally acting up what? again. What? Ew, gross. Secondly, Mr. Hattrick saw me writing in my diary during class, and he took it and he locked it in his desk. And he says he's going to give it to the principal tomorrow. If anyone sees what's in there, I will just die. It's really personal. Yeah, well, nothing like having the whole school know your deepest secrets. Makes your teenage years go by in a flash. Yeah, well, you'll soon find out. Me? Why? In the diary, I talk a lot about you and me. What? There is no you and me. Yeah, yeah, there is. See, first you rescued my notes from Mandy, and then we fell in love, and oh, you brought me flowers, what? and wrote me poetry, and showed this kinder, sensitive side that soon the whole world is gonna know about. We're like... Doomed lovers. Enough! Okay, I'll get your book back. Then we can kiss. The cold sores aren't contagious once they start to scab over. Where I saw Edna put a cat into the stew the other day.
Did you get it? Yes, I did. And I didn't read it. Much. Much obliged. Thank you for being my partner for this, uh, project. That's it? Move, nerd! Oh. <laughs> How original. <laughs> Call me a nerd. What next? Four eyes? Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt All me! Alright, you oh. have fun. What's this? <laughs> class... Paris... Den. Class president, dummy. It says class president. I know. I That's know. you? I'm the most suitable candidate I know! <laughs> yeah, so's your mom. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> oh, don't forget to wipe. <laughs> How's the campaign, Ernest? You'll vote for me, won't you? Yeah, not a chance. What if I pay you? Pay me? Now you're talking. I always knew I was a born leader. <laughs> yeah, but unless you buy everyone's vote, you're never gonna win. Because they are definitely gonna ruin your speech at the debate. Oh, unless I had a security manager. Oh, oh, please, please, please. I don't please, know. Security please, managers, they please. cost a lot of money. Oh, I have money. I can pay you. Good. I've always been a politician at heart.
Welcome. I won't mince words, my friends. This school needs help. My help. How many of you out there feel abused by society? Let down by the establishment. I'm gonna kick your ass. You want me to beat on you? Ow! I feel your pain, my children. Do not despair. <laughs> Salvation is here, my friends. Suck on this! By choosing me as your leader. Loser. Ouch! That's just not right! Hey, on this. stop it! You want me to whip you, huh? Ouch! This is intolerable! It's you, Ernest! Lackluster teaching! Gone! Physical education! Hey! Stop it! Don't give up, Ernest! Full work will be the model for a pure academic career. Money no longer wasted on silly people. Ow! Why is this happening? My opponent would have you believe you like this, you prick. that sports you are it. more meaningful for your... Ouch! What's up, Maggie? That's just not right! You scrawny little puke! Then decent textbooks Why do you even and draw? competent teachers! Hey, told you he was a weakling! What have sports Teacher done tech? for you? Cause pain and like misery. <laughs> While my opponent Andy. may also be more popular. What are you looking at, huh? Good looking and muscular. Nerd. And have the attention of the school bimbos. I really don't care what you say. He just you doesn't you, huh? have what it takes to be president. Ouch! You're this is intolerable! Some who claim I don't you represent the masses. I heard you like art class, you fruit. That means you want me to be out. Ouch! You? This is intolerable. Worthless. Ouch! That's just not right. Teacher's pet. It's time for change for the better. Come on, man. A vote for Ernest means a vote for... Suck on this! The triumph of brains over brawn! You couldn't! In closing, remember, a vote for E... means a vote for me! Thank you, everyone. Good night. Job well done. You may wait quietly. Wonder why no one picked Very this up.
really want to pee blood tonight? I put a costume in your closet. Put it on. Hey, what's going on? Not much. I was just lying here wishing I could be more like you. Yeah, whatever. But I'm cursed. Yeah? Really? <laughs> yeah. Cursed by brains. Do you know what torture it is to be thinking all the time? No, of course you don't. Yeah, you're cursed. You're great. Whatever. What else is going on? Not much. Let me see. Uh, it's Halloween. All the prefects are at some party and the teachers are entertaining, I use that word loosely, the kids. No, I'd say the opportunities for fun are pretty much nil. What do you have in mind? Come on, you'll see. Let's go get Pete. I got him a real nice costume. Guys, I look like I a jerk. I live for this! No, you look fine. Did you, you know, like, brush your teeth this morning? Dad! Whoa! Wow. I wish Mama could see this! Oh, Jimmy! <laughs> Look at that! that idiot attack! Someone better help him! Sounds good. Oh, thank you! What? That's kind of cool. Wow! Nice pants whip! I work hard! <laughs> Are you blind or Keep just dumb? On it. One day you may reach my level. <laughs> oh yeah. More importantly, did you have someone give you cool? Hey yes. You still gonna Everyone say that after I kick cool. your ass? They're obviously not measuring themselves up to me. Feeling sorry for Put yourself. Some more pain. Never helped anybody. I had Give me your money or get I'm green. I'm gonna be valedictorian. <laughs> That's great, but not as great as me. Later, alligator. For breakfast. Charity case. I'm so scared. <laughs> ah! <laughs> you both like idiots. watching dog. Get closer. Okay. Disappear, Someone Sinbad. 
told me Dad, Dad made a grenade out of an eraser. It looks like that new kid can't fight at all. Sometimes I think I'm ah! not mad. I really hate my... You're free! Um, Jimmy, could I ask your help? Cool, Jimmy. I'll tell yep, you okay. everything. Oh, many thanks. You got a handle on the situation? All right. Stop moving around! Just to let you know, Jimmy, I need your help. Yeah, I'm in. Thanks. You better not slow down, slow down. Both hands behind your head. Stop wearing. You're not a crane, fool's crew. You wanna mess with me? <laughs> there you are. Come on, I found something incredible. Hold on, relax, man. I can't keep getting in trouble. I can't get expelled again. It's always about me with you. Me, me, me. I'm thinking bigger picture. And you're worrying about getting into trouble? You know what? You really are something. What bigger picture? I'm, uh, we are gonna take over the school. We are not taking over anything right now. Time and tide wait for no man, my friend. But it seems they do wait for a wannabe tough guy who's nothing but a little girl. You're full of it. So you keep telling me. Look, now come on. I promise you, 
After this, things are never going to be the same again. Oh, I'm so excited. I should have stopped taking those pills ages ago. Yeah, right. Whatever you say, Gary. You suck so much, you should get beat! Hey idiots! Jimmy's gonna kick your ass! Right, Jimmy? Your mama hit back! Are you hurting yet? Look at the pimp we go! Get closer! Move, bitch! You're good! Get it! You're gonna hate me! Okay, stop! Having fun! You ain't nothing. I'm gonna make your life a misery! Don't stop! This is great! We make a great team. So much for the army! After you! This is a little different from how I remember it. You better lead the way. Would you hurry there, Jimmy? That cage wasn't locked before. We can't get in there. How can we get at the switch? There has to be a way to get into the cage. How can we get at the switch? We can't get in there. How can we get at the switch? switch how about you climb through that hole and press the switch there has to be a way to get into the cage we can't get in there how can we get at the switch we can't get in there how can we get at the switch There, Jimmy. We can't get in there. How can we get at the switch? Hey, 
Jimmy, see if you can knock the broom over somehow. Make it hit the switch. Hey, Jimmy, see if you can knock the broom over somehow. Make it hit the switch. Jimmy, you dunce! Use your slingshot to hit the broom. Hey, Jimmy! See if you can knock the broom over somehow. Make it hit the switch. You all right? Hey, Jimmy! See if you can knock the broom over somehow. Make it hit the switch. Hey, Jimmy! See if you can knock the broom over somehow. Make it hit the switch. Jimmy, you dunce! Use your slingshot to hit the broom. Jimmy, you dunce! Use your slingshot to hit the broom. Jimmy, you dunce! Use your slingshot to hit the broom. Jimmy, you dunce! Use your slingshot to hit the broom. Hey, Jimmy! See if you can knock the broom over somehow. Make it hit the switch. Knock the broom over somehow. Make it hit the switch. Jimmy, you dunce! Jimmy, over here! Now here's another switch I used to blow five wires! Another one for the collection. Almost there! I've heard of those happening, but I've never seen one. Sweet!
could lower the furnace temperature a bit, I bet the steam would stop. heats up again. It's right down there. Jimmy boy, here we are, the hole, the place where this school separates the men from the boys, the wheat from the chaff and all that nonsense. Okay, so what's that got to do with standing up to people, keeping them in line? This is where I stand up to you, my friend. What are you talking about? I know you hate me, Jimmy boy. I know you said all that stuff about me behind my back. What are you talking about? Don't play innocent with me. You want to run this school? I want to run this school. Only one of us is going to make it. And it's going to be me! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and morons, I give you Russell! Oh, man. Me, Russell! Gary, now I hate you. I know. Russell. Go beat that little jerk who said that nasty stuff to me about your mom and those barnyard uh, animals. What? Come here, Russ. You happy now, jerk? Ecstatic! I love to watch two morons beat the crap out of each other. Why'd you do it, Gary? I thought we were friends. <laughs> friends? You and me. I've taken dumps that had more brains than you, friend. No. I'm taking over this school. And you're just a liability. See you around, moron! Well done, Jimmy. Yeah, great. What a waste of time. You all right, Russell? Oh. Mm. Oh. Yeah? Look, I never said anything about your mom or farmyard animals. You did it? No, but I want you to stop bullying weak kids. Why? 
Ah, because there are a bunch of kids around this place who need a beating, and you're picking on the few who don't. So I want you to leave me and him alone. Oh, okay. Sorry. Bad Russell.